Our next step is going to be a little bit more difficult than the first step. We're going to take our block of foam, our file, our sandpaper, and our tube, and we're going to make our nose cone. The first thing we need to do is we need to make the shape that fits inside of the tube. This shape needs to be able to go in easily, but it also needs to be able to come out easily. But you don't want it to fall out, okay? So we're just going to simply take the rocket tube, put a nice impression on it, right there. That's roughly our circle. We're going to take our file and we're going to file it down until we get roughly to that round shape. This takes a few minutes and it takes patience. We'll come back in a moment. Now that we have almost very close to our final shape, it fits in nicely, it's just a little bit tight. I'm just going to take it down a little bit with just some sandpaper, just enough, barely any off of it, just enough so it fits in nice and easy. There, comes right out. We have to be able to blow it out. It needs to pop out just like that. Next thing we're going to work on is the cone shape. This is where it's going to take some time and you need some patience. So a file and some sandpaper, have a seat and relax and you'll get this down there. It takes patience. With a little bit of effort and some sandpaper we've been able to turn a square block of foam into our roughly shaped nose cone. This is about as good as I'm going to take this one, but if you really want to spend some time, you can really make it nice. You just have to make sure that it fits in there nice and easy. It doesn't have too much of an overhang around the body of the rocket, because you don't want it to look like a big mushroom, because the guide straw is going to get, the guide rod is going to get hung up on it. And it has to be able to pop out easily. Nice. There's my finished rocket cone. Looks alright. It should work. Fairly symmetrical. Decent. Try it back in the rocket tube. Fits in nice. Snug. Doesn't fall out. Good. That way when the ejector charge pops, that nose cone will pop right out without a problem.